Hello, I'm Spade. I've found that one of the most useful things I've done as I've been learning this game is watch my own play. I do this in part because I do all these videos, so I spend a lot of time looking at demos or video files that I've recorded, watching myself do stupid stuff, and uh, thinking about how I could do it differently next time. So recently, I played some pugs on Mirage, and uh, I figured I would go through a couple of rounds of my own play and do a little critiquing. And so these are complete rounds rather than the highlight clips that I've done. Highlight, I say, with obviously a little bit of my tongue in my cheek. And uh, just kind of see what I see. Cat. One cat. One's in the window. We have an AFK. Part of me wonders if I should have walked that earlier, but the guy who flanks me here from window would have done that anyway. I think I probably had more time than I thought I had. It worked out to jump through there because two of the guys had pushed out to cat. But realistically, what I should have done is uh, peeked it first. Smoke connector. Now, in the game, I promise you, I couldn't see as well as you can see through this Go TV demo. <laughs> so I really, I kind of knew there was a guy there from sound, but I didn't know where he was. And then the same story with the guys down below. Calm um, down, Cap. Yeah, right. Good old P90 BS. Calm down, and tell you. That works once in a blue moon, but I don't think that's a frequent way to win rounds. Hey, Kimmy, bro. Okay. I've gotten a little used to the Valve's nice. Mirage on matchmaking, yeah. so... This is an op peeking that window with an op is a lot more dangerous for me here because I really... I don't know where to line my crosshair up with that window shade anymore. I'm down, bro. I'm down here. I'm down right. Yeah, boy! Nothing mid. That's right. I should have seen the guy who was... Falcon. ...peeking jungle from inside apps. One, two, two. And then... I really should have known that... ...one of them could have crossed over to jungle here. Yeah. Flashing sight. He's inside. Oh my. CT. You looked right at him. There was He's right, I did look yeah. right at him. <laughs> I thought I was yeah. being flanked. So I gonna, turned. I'm gonna keep it, probably, right now, one thing that I need to work on is committing to an enemy. I tend to, I tend to be indecisive when I'm facing two enemies. And that gets me killed more often than not. This is an interesting spot here. I don't really have sight on ramp and apartment at the same time, which is fine as long as I have a teammate there and it gives me some cover. I'm not sure why I dropped. Probably didn't need to. One balcony, eh? Yeah, bomb down and I missed that because I just need to work on my aim. So I find that useful, uh, spending time watching my demos and sort of figuring out what I did right and wrong and trying to repeat it. I think that's really helped my overall play over the past couple of months. And it's been sort of an incidental thing because I didn't set out planning to do that. It's just a result of the fact that I do these videos. So if you don't already watch your own play, record demos, etc., I recommend doing that, at least after matches where you feel you did particularly well or particularly bad. I hope this was helpful. Spade out.